barbershop conversation guys charging station chronicles silent heroes y'all can do all of that man but um here's what's what's not being talked about in this whole situation how jerron ennis will be a political prisoner political prisoner under al Heyman and a little steven and pbc and showtime little steven i mean jerron ennis won't be a champion until 2025, 2025, 24. Yeah, because they only fight once a year, right? So 2025. And we talking about who's scared, who's this. In this team, y'all better wake up. Y'all better, better, better wake up. You think little Steven got your best interests at heart? Okay. Okay. I'm reloaded. It come to pain, big time. <laughs> and I'm only the messenger of the truth. I'm going to tell you, Jerron Ennis, Al Heyman has yet to give you an opponent. I repeat, era, era, scratch. Al Heyman has yet to give you an opponent. Era, era, scratch. Let's say it one more time. Jerron Ennis, Team Ennis, Boozy Ennis, Bozy Ennis, Team Ennis, the best fighter in, in the world in the next couple of years. Al Heyman has yet to give you an opponent. Era, era, scratch. Yeah, I'm. Yeah, y'all know the little guys and all that, but... He got seven big guys that he could have given you. You ain't got them. You can have the little guys. Yeah, you bring up a 140 guy like Lippinitz and you fight him and, you know, whatever the case may be. Y'all, yeah, but you got a lot. You got some seven B plus A fighters over there. One retired, Sean Porter. But uh, you got Ugas. You got Jamal James. You got uh, Earl Spence, Keith Thurman. You got Ippin, Ippin, what's his name? Ippin, what's his name? I don't know. The guy is supposed to fight Virgil Hunter. Virgil Ortiz. <laughs> Virgil Ortiz, that's his name, right? Victor Ortiz or Virgil Ortiz? I might as well say Victor Cruz, the wide receiver from the Giants. I just, I always screw up Victor Ortiz's name, man. Virgil Ortiz, excuse me. But um, but yeah, man. I'm just here to let you guys know. You being played. You're the welterweight version of Jamal Charlo. Jamal Charlo has been a Canelo carrot. Oh, the Canelo carrot. The Canelo carrot for three years. He ain't fought in almost two. Jerron Ennis, you're about to get on that train. You on it right now. Because if they don't unify, I just want to unify. Bring Triple G to Houston. I just want to unify. <laughs> hey, Jamal got some classic quotes out there, man. Dazzin! But if this doesn't happen, Bozy Ennis, and I'm going to be right, all right? I haven't been wrong. If I have, it's like 1% of the time. I can't recall. But in terms of the business and the common sense approach to boxing and Al Heyman's not giving you an opponent, little Steven is lying to you. The man had to go across the water to get a Karen. You know how many Karens we have in America? <laughs> Pun intended. <laughs> Excuse me for my clever satire. I mean, it's just the intelligence in me. I'm not a gangbanger. I'm not a hood dude. Only, I ain't been to jail. I've been to a holding cell. I'm not, I don't want that tough guy image. I'm a money getting, asset getting. Damn. I'm filthy rich, y'all. I'm filthy rich. Damn. I've never said that before. First time ever in my life I've ever said I'm filthy rich, but I am. Excuse me for the arrogance. Let me, now back to our scheduled program. Um, I wish you luck, Jerron. Boots Ennis and all my videos are perceived as hate un until it really really happens y'all gonna see what Jerron Ennis next opponent who is it gonna be y'all gonna see little Steven ain't paying that money little Steven ain't paying three million dollars for Ugas five million dollars for, for Crawford he's not
Y'all go ahead and enjoy the rest of your day, man. Me and Lincoln about to go to basketball practice, about to go pick him up to highlight one of the highlights of my day. And uh, yeah, man, y'all keep on enjoying the high life, man. Y'all keep on thinking family life is boring and conservative and what republic. The... Y'all think raising families is a Republican thing, believing in God and building assets. Y'all think that's being conservative and boring. Yes, yeah, it's, it's boring. It's super boring. You know, it's boring enough that I'm about to pull up into a mansion and be filthy rich. Oh, you arrogant. You always talk about money. But the rest of YouTube talk about other people's money. I do too. But I can also put my money on the table. Barbershop conversations, man. I, I was trying to find a way to, to uh, sarcastically... What word did I use? Sarcastic? Surrogate? What? I forget, but yeah, man. Jerron Boo saying this, man, um, you got to figure out a way. And you're in a tough position. So if you don't get a Karen, maybe you can get a BLM. <laughs> maybe you can get a BLM. They gave you a Karen. Maybe little Steven got a BLM, BLM member up his sleeve, up his short sleeves. Barbershop conversations, man. Y'all have a great day, man. I'm gone. Peace.